Hello, oh, Tauruses. Welcome to your mid-month tune-up for October 2022. If it resonates, consider a personal pre-recorder or live reading. Just send me an email, DM, or text me at 646-902-5715. Let's get to your reading. Holy Spirit, angels, divine guides, universe. Can you please invite your truth, your wisdom, your clarity, and your insight for a Tauruses for the middle of October 2022? What do you see? What do they need to know to reach your higher ground, become closer to the universe and closer to divine? For your messages, any messages would be greatly appreciated. And we thank you. What do you see? What what do they need to know? General energies for you all is the magician card <clears throat> in the upright. Make sure you click on the Vimeo link below for your extra extra, which will have your love, your career, your finances, and your health in there specifically. We have the death card in reverse for the challenge position. In my playlist, 2023 sun moon predictions are being uploaded slowly but surely put your requests in the comments i will put you in queue check out your 2022s while you're waiting see if they rang true for you nine of imps in reverse for advice hmm. okay and look me up on facebook instagram like share subscribe or donate and any of the links below in support of my efforts always appreciated for moving out of october into November, mid-October, November, Ace of Ghosts in reverse. That that card keeps on coming up a lot. Um, just just in the in the readings um, across the board. So it looks like general energies. Uh, you're trying to make something happen. <laughs> there's there's some kind of vision that you have, and you've decided, okay, I need to make this happen. You've already you know you have your eyes fixed on it, and pretty much with you guys, when you um, you know decide upon something, you're very resolute that it's going to happen. So I'm very determined that it's going to happen. Um, you know, it, it might it might be a very slow process, um, but you know you're you're bound to succeed okay and, and there's no talking you out of it um so there is something going on that you want to create you want to make happen um like i said something you envisioned and you want to turn it into a reality uh and this is the start of a totally new cycle okay so um i, I just think you're generating a new cycle for yourself and you're using everything you have available to you so you know knowledge skills talent um anything that's at your disposal friends like whatever you uh possibly have to make this happen you're definitely going to use it in addition to the magic that you have to kind of make things happen um which is your determination so that's what we're kind of seeing there um death card from reversed is in the challenge position so i think the problem is you can't entirely focus your energies on this because you're still kind of hung up with something else um i or i feel like there's a resist like somebody is trying to resist you changing you doing this uh maybe they're trying to hold on to you um but for some reason, I feel like you can't leave uh, a, a situation and move into this new energy. Um, I don't know if you're obligated uh, to something or somebody or, um, you know, that it's going to cause problems for you or they're going to cause problems for you. But I just see that you can't kind of um, can't kind of move forward with the change. Um I don't feel like you're doubting yourself. I don't feel, feel like you're being reluctant. I feel like it's just a situation you can't leave. Um, the nine of imps is here in the reverse for advice. And what I'm getting from that, I was kind of teetering between a couple of things, but I'm kind of honing in and I'm feeling as though they're telling you to be very, very guarded. Be very protective of what you have. I mean almost to the point where you feel like someone's going to steal it. So if you have something, let's just say it's a patent, or you're working on a patent, or you're working on something that can be copyrighted, or, you know, something that's ingenious, um, make sure you're looking over your shoulder. Make sure you're kind of looking at the people around you. Uh, make sure nobody is overhearing your conversations. Um, because I feel as though there's somebody that's trying to either sabotage it or trying to take it from you. So they're just telling you to be very, very guarded, very guarded. Um, you know, build an absolute seal force. I mean, force? Fort. Fort around yourself so that it doesn't get invaded. Somebody does not come in, um, you know, and infringe on your territories and take something from you. 
Moving forward, we have the Ace of Ghosts in reverse. And this is why I think it's really important that you guard what you have. Because as we move out of October, November, I see you being upset because of something happened. Emotionally upset. Um, because it didn't work out. But I feel like it didn't work out because of this interference that you had or this interfering energy. And I think that it's really going to kind of hit you hard. I feel as though you're going to have a hard time believing uh, that you can make it happen again, uh, believing in yourself. Um, I think it might affect your confidence. Um, you, I don't feel like you're going to let anybody show. You're not going to have your feelings on your sleeve. You don't want anybody to know how upset or disappointed you are. You guys are really good at putting a very cool and composed mask kind of going on and um, you know, put stuffing your feelings away. Um, but I think you're going to be upset moving forward. I don't think it's going to work out quite the way that you envisioned it. And I do think it's because somebody interfered. Why is the magician card here in the upright? Who's this person? What's this energy? Okay, we have the two of cups in the upright. A can personal connection with somebody, an emotional connection with somebody. Um, it could be a romantic liaison. So, you know, here you are, want to manifest something with this person, somebody that is very much like you, you guys see eye to eye, um, everything is vibing. It can also be a business partner, starting up a business or connecting with somebody who's on board to kind of help you with this magic, so to speak. Um, the star card in the upright is a card of Aquarius. And this is you rising up out of uh, previous challenges. So I feel like you went through a lot and you've bounced back from it and this is your out or this is the way to recreate yourself and make something happen whether it's a relationship or whether it's a situation of some sort and I'm also seeing with the nine of swords in reverse um, that you literally came out of a very difficult time absolute rock bottom um, you know so this is really important to you that this happens I feel like you're investing everything you have into this um, you know whether it's with someone else on board or whether it's singularly um, that's what I'm kind of getting. You're pouring your heart and soul into this. Why is the death card here in reverse for Tauruses? Who's this person? What's this energy? Yeah, there's, there's something on the home front or whatever you consider your home that is problematic. There's somebody you share an office with, a home with, something like that that is trying to cause problems with you. They're starting to insert doubt into you. They're telling you you can't do something. Um, yeah, it's family. It, it's somebody, it's a family member, whoever you consider family. Family. They don't want you to be happy. They don't want you to be abundant. They want, don't want you to be successful. Um, so they're really trying to get in there and make this not happen. I don't know if it's because they're selfish and they don't want to lose you or something in that regard. Um, but that's what's kind of happening with that. Um, they want to, they want to kind of, they don't want you to move out. You don't want you to move on. Um, why is the nine of imps here in reverse for advice? Who's this person? What's this energy? So they don't want you to move on. I feel as though they're going to do anything they can. Um, I, I feel like this person came in and just knocked your damn cups over. I feel like you were working on something and they just came in and kicked them over and said, there, there, now you can't do it. You know what I mean? And I think you're very distraught about that. I mean, they're telling you the advice is this person might come and do that. They might destroy what you did. Um, you know, just to destroy it so that you can't kind of move on or change or what have you and be very cautious of that. Like I said, look over your shoulder, be paranoid, look for this person. Um, be very aware. Okay. Justice card in the upright. You may have a legal issue. You may have legal recourse with this person or this happening. You might be able to get some sort of injunction or you might be able to get some sort of a uh, protection order or a restraining order or something like that uh, to, you know, um, make this person go away. I feel if you do kind of um, pursue a legal thing, uh, it's actually going to end up on your side and be advantageous to you or so they're saying. Um, and then I feel like this person, either you or the other person is going to actually uh, move away. So there will be a large amount of distance between the two of you I think um, if you take advice and go ahead and do this um, I feel like it's you pushing away from this person and their energies and moving towards something much more positive why is the ace of ghosts here in reverse who's this person what's this energy yeah, I think the damage is done as you move out of October to November. I think that they uh, did enough stuff to kind of uh, um, set you back quite a bit. Um, of course, you can, now that you're aware of this, <laughs> you can certainly do things to avoid this. But I think that they, they changed your trajectory of where you wanted this to go and where you wanted uh, to be. Um, 
you know, maybe they advised you, they gave you ill advice. Uh, maybe they, you know, sabotaged you or some sort. Maybe they didn't tell you stuff that you should have known. Um, I see you working very hard to come back from it though. Um, there was a setback, but you're kind of saying to yourself, you're hell bent determined and saying, okay, disappointed and really set back. But if I work really hard, I can kind of, um, you know, get back what, uh, what I started out doing or, or, you know, what I started building. Um, I see this person's not happy about it with the Queen of Swords in reverse. They're trying to, you know, be spiteful, um, say kind of nasty things to you and, um, you know, attack you and things of that, uh, regard to try to, um, distract you again. Um, I wouldn't feed into that. I think you should kind of continue working, um, on what you're doing it'll help you kind of get your confidence back to and uh belief in yourself so that's what i have for you all if it resonates consider a personal pre-recorded or a live reading uh nine of cups popped out i don't necessarily know it was a popper but i know people will be like oh, you had to read on it um you know so, so if it, if this were a popper i would say uh focus on your abundance on your happiness making it happen um the nine of cups is about having you know all the cups except for the tenth cup uh which isn't a bad thing um, uh, wishes coming true, um, really good health, um, and making things happen. So anyway, so for resonates, consider personal pre-recorded or live reading, email, DM me, or text me at 646-902-5715. Otherwise, click on the Vimeo link below for your extra extra, which will have your love, your career, your finances, and your health in there specifically in my playlist or your 2023 sun moon predictions that are still coming out. Put your requests in the comments. I will put you in queue. Uh, check out your 2022 sun moon uh, predictions. That are still in there see if they rang true for you check out the accuracy 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 of those before you check out your 2023s and then also look me up on facebook instagram like share subscribe or donate in any of the links below in support of my efforts um always greatly appreciated otherwise tauruses i will see you in the video reading adios from veronica garnett bye